So now we have a rough guide of the teething phases. We can start to delve into each age range a little more so you know what you're up against. Starting off at zero to three months of age. So when your puppy is born, they've got no teeth at all. And then when they hit roughly around three weeks of age, those baby teeth begin to push through the gums. And at six weeks old, almost all of the teeth are finally through. And then finally at eight weeks old, you will have a puppy with a full set of baby teeth. So in those first eight weeks, they've already developed a set of teeth. So most dog owners have been able to avoid their first teething stage, unless of course you're the breeder, in which case you've had to endure that as well. Most puppies are collected at around about eight weeks of age, where he or she has already developed their first full set of teeth. And this typically leaves around four weeks of them being at home with you before the teething really kicks in. So in that first four weeks, I encourage you to make the most of those puppy cuddles. Even though teething may not have started yet at this point, your dog will still bite. This is likely due to exploring and playing. Think about the first eight weeks of their life when they were with their brothers and sisters. They probably played really rough with their siblings and biting was actually fun and it was a big part of their interaction and play. At three months, your puppy begins to absorb the roots of his or her baby teeth. At four months, those baby teeth begin to loosen and fall out. Don't be surprised if you find them everywhere. But also, if you find none, again, don't be concerned. Most Labradors tend to swallow them with their food. At six months, all of those baby teeth should have now shed. And at eight months old, you'll find that most puppies will now have all of their adult teeth. And to now put the pain of teething into perspective, think how painful it is when you have toothache. Your puppy feels that times by 42. It's incredibly painful for them. And as they transition from puppy to adult, those 28 baby teeth are going to be replaced by a lovely set of 42 great big pearly whites. At nine plus months of age, all teething should now be complete that full set of 42 adult teeth are established. The need to chew for pain relief is now over. However, the biting or nipping may continue. And although the need to chew or bite for pain relief should now have passed, if your dog continues to chew or bite, it's likely because they have learned that that behavior gets them some attention. So going back to one of my previous comments, this is why it's really important to show a puppy from an early age that biting has a consequence that they do not necessarily want to encourage. 